All right, so we want good audio for our Insta360 X4 right here. And I already went ahead and set up like a little rig with our tripod here attached to the base of our Insta360 selfie stick and with a quick release there, as you can see. And at the base, you got the quick release base as well that goes on to this like that and makes up for very easy swap between mounts. You know, you have your chest mount, sometimes you might have your chain mount on your full face helmet and such stuff. But to get a perfect little rig, I went ahead and ordered this mic extension adapter. It's written on it. You could get it from AliExpress. I'll put links in the description. In the case, you got something like this that goes under the base of your x4 and then a cable let me just show you it's a, a lot easier shown so i'm just gonna release a uh, quick release you see there and then you want to take uh, your quick release base held down with a quarter inch screw like this right so you want to take that out uh that always happens when you're filming okay <laughs> can't help it and then on the battery side right if you got x4 you know the battery size is going to be on this side and then the little mount goes underneath and then you want to use of course provided you want to use it with a quick release which i advise anyway you know some people don't want to use it that way but i you know i have multiple mounts so i need to use it that way so in case you want to go that route you pull your mount base underneath and then screw it down that way uh, see that and so far the audio you've been listening to has been from the Rode Wireless Pro that's the with the inbuilt 32-bit float audio right uh, and now we're gonna turn on the Insta360 so you can hear the difference between the inbuilt microphone of the X4 compared to the 32-bit just for some reference okay and now uh, I'm gonna turn it on so we're recording in 5.7K mode and that's the audio coming from the inbuilt microphone of your X4. Now, how does it compare with the Rode Wireless Pro? That's the inbuilt microphone. And now I'm gonna turn it off and we just continue with our rig building, okay? So stop. And now also I'm gonna sample a few audios coming from my iPhone because I'm filming with the iPhone 14 Pro Max and the entire scope of the video is combining the X4 that's the Insta360 X4 with the Rode Wireless Pro if you want that crisp just extra step to get that crisp audio so there are options like you could use the uh, inbuilt microphone of your X4 you could use your phone but the point is using the X4 here so you could use the X4 or you could use the internal recordings on your wireless pro or you could actually have the Rode wireless pro hardwired into your x4 and to get that of course you're gonna need your mount and then with this little extra thing to buy that's the mic adapter all right it's from x4 it's from insta360 excuse me uh you're gonna unbox it that's some instructions and then when you open it up you get something like this take it out and this snug already okay so put it on to a quick release i'm gonna take your little adapter and i'm doing this in real time so excuse me for my unprofessionalism but i don't care <laughs> it's supposed to be an outdoor action camera with an action audio rig all right so this goes into your little USB-C port and there's a door here, right? I took off that door and I, you know, just be careful with it because so, as soon as you open this and then you keep it somewhere, right? Now you've already compromised the integrity of uh, the waterproofness of your X4. So just uh, throw that, slide that in right there. So it comes up easily as well. So you put this, right? That's your audio adapter. Goes right into there. Oh and you get your road and what you see here is the tx right? this 
Liberty X, that's the transmitter, and here you have your receiver, that's the RX. And on the side, you have like an audio jack that takes a 3.5 millimeter. What? What do we hear there? Let me keep it recording. Start recording. Ha <laughs> ha. So we're recording in 5.7K mode. Now, how does it compare with the Rode Wireless Pro? That's the inbuilt microphone. And now I'm gonna turn it off. And we just continue with our rig building, okay? You're gonna have a clip on the side. All right. Pretty sturdy clip as well. And it just goes right onto this. This is specifically designed for the Rode Wireless Pro, okay? So it goes right there. It's snug right there. And I can even make it a little snugger, <laughs> if that's a word. So, oh, yeah. take that off. It's for your magnet, by the way. So you take your clip and it goes on to that. And it's snug, okay? It's not going nowhere. All right, so you plug the, just making sure not to press any button accidentally. So you just make that. Or you could do it the other way. Both ends the same, by the way. And that plugs right into your X4. And hopefully we got audio now. Oh, Hardwired into the X4. Hopefully. Because <laughs> now the screen's turned off. All right, so from this point on, uh, hopefully you can hear uh, what the X4 sounds like with the audio adapter and the wireless pro that the Rode Wireless Pro hardwired into your Insta360 X4. And that's what it sounds like. And it's a busy park for Tuesday morning. Like, my God, they got trains, they got public transport. There's a street right behind me there, you can see it. What does it sound like compared to, you know, you got options and we all love options, right? You got, like I said, audio from the Insta360 X4. You got hardwired audio, which in many cases, many people will uh, audio that is your best option as far as uh, audio quality goes and you could also have the 34 bit float as your backup right oh yeah i believe that's it so if you're interested in one of these products out here um you could check the link in the description you got your oh and it's windy out here it's blowing everything all over the place so I'll leave the link in the description in case you guys are interested in picking one of these up. In, I guess that is it. We covered everything. <laughs> All right. So now, if you're vlogging, maybe on the street, let me just take a walk a little bit. Let me just take a hike. So if you're vlogging, Again, doesn't matter how far you extend your selfie stick, it's still gonna be pumping out quality audio. All right, and just like uh, your Insta360 is designed to work, and the Rode Wireless Pro also comes with two RXs. No, not the RX, the TX, because the RX is going to be your receiver. So you can plug uh, a friend, a wife, a significant other, or your ex wife. <laughs> you can plug them as well, and then and uh, switch it on to uh, the stereo mode, for instance, where the audio gets split into left and right channels. That way, you have independent audio to be edited. So, yeah, that is it for now. I think I'm recording in mono. Doesn't matter, I can always uh, tweak that in post. So, that is it, guys. You have a perfect little <laughs> look at me <laughs> talking freaking far away from the camera. So, that is it. Yeah. Guys, you got a perfect little rig with your Rode Wireless Pro hardwired into your X4 together with a quick release mount so that way you can always switch between mounts easily. And let me just demonstrate that. Uh, you can put this, <laughs> it's not the quickest release, but <laughs> oh, alright. So you have that. 
That is enough quality one, but it's okay. So you got that, and you could also put this. Uh, you could easily swap between your selfie stick and then just put it elsewhere. Maybe on your chest mount, on your bike, on my scooter in my case. And so many other places that you, that you might be mounting your X4. And with the Insta360 being uh, 4K, that's the combination of 4K lenses on both sides together to form a 360 sphere and that's why you have the 360 effect right and in between those lenses you're gonna have uh, something like an imaginary stitch line that's where the magic happens and as long as you have your wireless setup within that line no weird artifacts should be popping out in your final image so as you can see if i move it slightly to the side right now you start seeing some weird stuff like let me try it in real time and hopefully we're gonna be able to see that i don't want to ruin it but oh like now you should be seeing something right now <laughs> you should be seeing something and uh, hopefully we can straighten that and it should disappear all right so that is it there you have your road wireless pro hardwired thanks to the audio adapter into uh insta 360x4 with no weird artifacts in our image. So now let me just so now let me just play around with the, this while we're recording to see if you can hear the audio difference right there. Let me just unplug this. Can you hear any difference? So now I'm just disassembling everything. You guys, please let me know if you hear a significant difference in the audio quality. Now that's the audio coming straight out of the X4 without any hard wiring. And one other good thing about this kind of setup is you got audio bars right there at the top of the screen. And prior to this time, I always recorded just blindly. I can't really monitor my audio levels, right? But with the hardwired setup you have audio bars being displayed in real time right there so not only are we getting signal the audio is being transmitted between the receiver and the transmitter with the showing of this microphone icon and the audio levels up there at the top of the screen on the audio receiver itself you also get some audio levels going on and that's it any more questions Please leave a comment in the comment section. Maybe I'm doing something wrong or maybe something I might have uh, done perfectly. Is there anything missing? Let me know in the comment section, okay? Yes, yes, yes. I'll see you in the next video. Oh.